That's what I'm talking about. Super Saiyan mode. Let's go. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> Yo, what's up guys? We're gonna be checking out the Ultimate Dragon Ball Z Recap Cartoon. You already know I'm a huge fan of Dragon Ball Z, Dragon Ball, and Dragon Ball Super. We don't talk about GT on this channel though. We don't talk about that. All right, here we go, on the Flying Nimbus. Is that Goku? No, that's Goku. Oh man. Yo, in my personal opinion, he wasn't a good father, you know? How you gonna abandon your kids like that? Let him get raised by a, a, a big ass slug. Yep, Raditz just snatched his ass. That was like, what, episode one? Krillin gang owned like always. And Piccolo just pulls up like, yeah, bro, we finna go, we finna go jump him. <laughs> My boy Gohan! Gone with that headbutt. And this was the first time I was shocked, man. No, I think Dragon Ball got me shocked when they killed Krillin, but Goku dying, that seemed impossible. Yeah, use the Dragon Balls, bring him back, we're all good. He's like, I want the Dragon Balls now. Yo, like, in this universe, would you even be afraid of death? Like, you can be wished back. And Bulma hitting Krillin again. Thank you. I thought we were gonna have to watch him run down Snake Way again. It took forever. And yes, this is part of training, you know, cleaning his car. Man, I'd be forget. Oh, Popo, Popo. I remember in like the like remastered or whatever version they made him blue. Y'all already know why. I don't even know how Popo was a thing to begin with. Yeah, Popo, stop. No, you're not allowed to be in here, man. Pe people find you offensive. My boy Gohan's first transformation, that was so dope. And he's gonna blow up the moon. Like, we don't need the moon, you know. <laughs> Rock, paper, scissors, who goes first? Oh, Yamcha. Oh, Yamcha. How are you gonna get beat by the green jolly giants? Not even giants. They're, <laughs> they're dwarves, man. You got beat by broccoli. <laughs> I think that was one of the biggest L moments Yamcha has ever. I, no, if not the biggest L moment. Bro got beaten by some cabbage. Like, what? Some Brussels sprouts. No wonder Bulma left you and got with the real man. Like, even though this man did attack Earth a couple years ago, he was a real man. Vegeta was a real man. And Yamcha is just, you know, Yamcha. So embarrassing. This man got beaten by collard greens. <laughs> That's a weird looking dragon. What's up, man? No, not the panties again. Stop with the panties. Thank you, Bulma. You're like the only one with sense in that group. Yes, yeah, all part of training. Back rubs, training. <laughs> He's gonna miss him. Oh my gosh. I remember that happening. <laughs> I remember his hand coming off because... Cause Nappa just, just bitch slapped it off. Piccolo, where you at? See, I've always wondered why did he just pick up Gohan and get out the way? <laughs> oh my God, you're picking up pieces of him? Oh my gosh, that's so, that's so wrong. He was trying to put him back together. Goku, you, you, you showed up late like always. You got how many of your friends body? Four of them? Aww. You gotta finish the famous line. Ooh, that a nut shot? And GG Nappa. I would say this was probably... No, 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 no. The Namek ba a battle was too dope, bro. Bust out that Kaioken. There you go. What a big slap. That's what I'm talking about. Kaioken? Kaio what? <laughs> Shout out Team Four Star. And we got the famous Gallant Gun versus Kamehameha stream of beam struggle, bruh. Times four on your ass. That's what I'm talking about. Sit down. Oh, yeah, then he replicated the moon, became the great ape. 
And Yajirobe saves the day. Gosh! I know that was painful. <laughs> I think that was like the last thing that Yajirobe did that actually helped out the group, that actually saved the world. You know, cutting off the tail was a big moment for Yajirobe. After that, he was just on Korn's lookout, just eating sensu beans and, you know, doing nothing, bro. I, I was actually kind of shocked because they introduced him in Dragon Ball. I was expecting him to be a Z fighter, but no, cuts off tail and then just pieces out. Oh my gosh, that was a justice kick. You're still crying over Piccolo? You'll be back. We just gotta go to Namek. He's over here giving Krillin a head rub. <laughs> All right, the Frieza saga. This is probably my most favorite saga, man. What a good idea. Let's go to outer space and get some magical orbs that will grant any wish. You know, if we, were, if we already didn't have some on Earth, I wouldn't believe you. <laughs> Who remembers the muffin button? Is this gonna be fake Namek or the real Namek? No, this is the real one. <laughs> Look at Bulma, she's just like, um, I'm out of here. <laughs> Yo, Frieza was the, was a savage, bro. He was one of the biggest dogs ever, bro. And Frieza stood on business all day, every day. <laughs> oh yeah. This is when Vegeta was just murking motherfuckers, bro. Everybody was catching around with Vegeta. This man was catching bodies. You know, he, he he had to recover after the Zarbon fight, but after that, catching bodies. <laughs> oh my gosh, what's up with people rubbing your head? Uh, is, is he getting pleasure from it? Is he creamy his pants? Ew, uh, don't ever do that again. And then Vegeta pulled off the coolest heist ever. How are you going to rob Frieza? You a brave man. Ah, uh, I'm you force. With the TikTok dances. <laughs> Dance on me, I just hit the lottery. Uh. <laughs> there you go, Vegeta. Save it. Oh my gosh! Okay. That's one way to do it. <laughs> ah, and Goku saves the day like always. It always arrives fashionably late. Uh. I want your body. Give me that body. I want them cheeks, boy. What will be the first thing y'all do if y'all got a brand new body? Look in the mirror. I already know what y'all thinking. <laughs> and now you're a frog. Enjoy life. <laughs> Like, Goku is always arriving, you know, whooping ass for a little bit and then getting injured and is out of the episode for like the next 15 episodes. Yeah, bring back old Piccolo. Piccolo's black, I don't care what anybody says. He's black, he's a homie, he's invited to the barbecue. Look guys, I love Dragon Ball Z, it's very nostalgic to me. I started watching when I was a kid. I love Goku, do not get me wrong. But there's a lot of valid slander against Goku. You know, he's not the best father. He always shows up late to every single battle like, bro, we need you, Goku. We need you. How are you gonna be the strongest in the world and always showing up late like you African, bro? Like, show your fashion be late like you black. Piccolo's the black one, bro, and he be showing up on time. All right, this is where he fuses with Nail. Oh yeah! I feel good! I feel great! I can do it! Oh! That was nasty. <laughs> and then you see all of your dead homies. Oh my! Nope! This is not what happened, but hey. I mean, why not, right? Go ahead and get you a nice little meal in. <laughs> no, Vegeta. You're not gonna get your wish. Because in a couple of seconds, he's gonna die. <laughs> like, he picked the worst time to pass on, bro. You couldn't wait just a little bit. Man, Vegeta looking mad evil, bro. Oh, Frieza. Ah! This man impaled Krillin. Give him that horn action. 
This man Frieza was, was extra horny that day. <laughs> and Vegeta almost killed himself. <laughs> Trying to get a power up boost. Yep, alien version. <laughs> In final form, Frieza. Ooh! And then Goku finally wants to arrive. He finally wants to be like, you know what? I'm all healed up. Let's go and fight. For a guy who loves fighting, he shows up pretty late. Gosh! Every time you show up late, you show up to some of your friends dead. Ugh, that's what I'm talking about! Super Saiyan mode! Let's go! Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> Alright, this is pretty dope. This is pretty dope, guys. This animation is going next level. There is not a kid alive or adult now because this aired way back in the day, but there's not an adult alive right now that can say when they seen the scene, they weren't hype AF. Yo, I think I spent like a good week trying to go Super Saiyan just like Goku, though, screaming, the, you know, the clutching of my cheeks and everything, bro. I really thought I was gonna unlock my potential. Yeah, take it, Frieza. I don't care how buff you get, bro. You dealing, you're not dealing with the average Saiyan anymore. <laughs> and Popo is still blurred out. <laughs> Yo, the, the wishes that they'd be doing on this show, man. Man, just give me one wish. Just give me one wish, bro. You'd be wishing for the dumbest things, man. I mean, I guess wishing your friends back isn't dumb. But still, though. <laughs> oh my gosh. No, sir. Don't let him go, Koof. Yup. <laughs> Look at him, just pieces on the floor. <laughs> and he did it to himself. That's the most hilarious part. You gonna put him back together? <laughs> I guess he didn't want to live life like that, being half a man. <laughs> Congratulations, Goku. You defeated Frieza. <laughs> well, not even. He comes back as a robot. But still, though, you took that dub. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. I mean, you know, Tien and Chiatsu has always had that special relationship. Look at Bulma twerking on Vegeta in the back, and he doesn't even care. And Yamcha is still dead. Yo, there's so many little hidden jokes in there. <laughs> All right, man, that was the Dragon Ball Z recap. If you saw this recap, you essentially saw Dragon Ball Z for the most part. Go ahead and leave a comment on which series was your favorite, Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Z, Dragon Ball GT, or Dragon Ball Super. I'm probably have to go with Dragon Ball Z. After that, I'll go with Dragon Ball and then Super. And then of course, GT is dead last. But that was it for this video, guys. My name is Prince of Hawkum. Stay charming, my friends.